do horseshoe crab sting. What? Do. <laughs> bro, of course. Let me just. You know what, bro? Of <laughs> Yo, what's going on guys? It's Matash24. Now I'm about tired of these dumbass people getting trending. Trending off of some dumbass shit, bro. Literally, this dude by the name of Brave Wilderness, they make a, a video called Do Horseshoe Crabs Even Sting? Man, of course they sting! What the heck do you think? Man, I mean... What do you think, jellyfish don't sting? Oh, oh, yeah, they're just little jellies. They just, you touch it, it just feels really gooey. Man, freak that, of course it does! Wait, here we go. We're gonna watch this video. It's gonna be trash, but, uh, let's get to it. Mark? What's wrong? Are you ready to see an alien? All right, first off the bat, are you ready to see an alien? Push the soul in the freaking 50, man, what the, hmm. What, man? A freaking tree? Whoa! Dude, this grass is like full. Yeah, dude, like. Tiny this, dude, 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 yeah, dude, this, like, this grass, bro, it has like. Oh, jeez! Look at that! Oh, jeez! Listen! That's like popcorn! Sounds like rain. Yeah, it does. I think those are sand fleas. Let me grab one. Did bite? Uh, I believe so. All fleas, as far as I know, bite. I can't grab them. They're too small and fast. Jeez, they're jumping all over me. Here, come over here, look at this. Let me check this grass. Be what the hell? Point your camera down right here. This is the exact same sort of seaweed, dried up seaweed sculpture. Ah, oh, see, look at that. I just step on them, and they're everywhere. Watch, ready? Yeah. One, two. Oh my gosh! What? Look at that! What? Put my hand in there? Yeah. All right. All right, here, let me. Put your hand! Peel back some more. White people, bro. Okay. White dumb people. All right, I'm not saying all white people, bro, but like. Uh, but like, uh, that feels really weird. Ah, uh, no, dude. They're just jumping on me. Here, let me peel back this a little bit more. Ew! Look at that. There are millions of them. Oh gosh, that's crazy. Oh, bro, my mom have a fit, bro. This. As we continue the coastline, we soon realized it was As we continue the go coastline, you can see that oh my god, it's an alligator! Wow, this shit's really cool! Whoa! Cool. I carefully examined potential hiding spots Bitch. where animals may be waiting for the tide to return. But so far, aside from thousands of fleas, I wasn't seeing a single living creature. The sun was getting low in the sky, and all of a sudden, our luck took the perfect turn and put us right in the midst 
of an animal we had always hoped to get up close for the cameras. It's talking about the crab tree, I think. That crab thing, whatever it's called. It's a turtle! Wow! Gonna put this on film. No bro, 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 this is disgusting, bro. There. Uh, they've gotten a bad reputation because of this tail. People think that that's venomous. It actually is not. Ow, ow, ow. But the side little spikes there are definitely very, very spiny. Let me see if I can get it to just lay in the palm of my hand. Ooh, that feels really, really creepy. Now, it's called a horseshoe crab, but it's not actually related to crabs at all. It's more closely related to spiders and scorpions. This is one large arthropod. Now, ooh, wait, ooh, it is pinching me a little bit. They do have these front pedipalps up front that they use to harvest food out of the basin of the ocean. Wow, I'm like so excited right now. Hold on, I gotta go I mean, that's just kind of cool, but like, I did not think we were I'm not touching to that. A horseshoe crab out here. Now, if you look straight on, where it gets the name horseshoe crab, let me hold it like that. Looks just like a horseshoe, right? Totally. And if you look right at the front of the face there, you see these little spots? Those are compound eyes. Crab eyes. This animal has nine eyes in total. The two right here, five light sensing eyes. Nine eyes, bro, therapist. what the? And then on the underside, two simple eyes that they actually use to kind of sense their environment. And scientists think that the eyes on the underside are actually just left over from when they were in a larva stage. So wait, those are eyes on the top of that? Yes, and it actually it looks like a face, doesn't it? You see that? I always thought that that was just like a helmet, like a shell protection. Well, the top of this animal is called the carapace, just like a lot of other arthropod species. This is a very what dense, very hard exoskeleton. They don't actually have an endoskeleton, you know, bones and cartilage like a human. That's disgusting! Side, look at that. Looks just like a scorpion or a spider. Whoa. Can I touch the, uh, the top of it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's, yeah. Totally safe. Up. Yep. Totally uh, set. Yep. Ah! It's just like a turtle shell, actually. Yeah, well, I thought it was a turtle when we first walked up. And look, you've got some sort of a barnacle growing up on top of it. It's covered in a little bit of algae and seaweed. Now, here's something that you may not know. It's something very cool. Let me turn it like this and just hold it in the palm of my hand. That is me holding a living fossil. The ancestors of the horseshoe crab have been on the planet for over 450 million years. And this species right here is the Atlantic horseshoe crab. There's only four horseshoe crab species in the world. This is the only one that can be found off the coast of the United States. And this one specifically, this design, the Atlantic horseshoe crab, has not changed in over 230 million years. That dates back to the Triassic period. So this creature was crawling around on the basin of the ocean during the time of the dinosaurs. How cool is that? Now they do get quite a bit bigger than this. Should have called it a stingray. The female, the females are. Thing looks like a stingray on the water. Larger than the males. Wow, it's almost impossible to hold on to. Look at the underside. It does look like a stinger. It does, and that's why people are afraid of these things. They think that they're going to get stung. Look at this. No, this tail is actually just used like a rudder. Although it does have all these barbs, it's very intimidating, but it cannot hurt you at all. In fact, if a horseshoe crab gets flipped on its back like that. See, it tries to right itself up, it actually can't. And that's a big misnomer that these arthropods are capable of flipping themselves back over. There's actually a conservation effort that was launched uh, in the 80s called Just Flip Em. And the Just Flip Em concept is that if you're walking down the beach and you see a horseshoe crab that's flipped on its back like this from like a crashing of a wave, what you're supposed to do is just gently grab the carapace and flip it right side up. Now you don't want to pick it up by its tail because you can actually injure the animal if you hold it like that. Look at that mark, it's coming right towards you. Oh man. Do they ever come on land for anything or are they uh, purely aquatic? Well, between June Just and get to the part if it can sting you, bro. To, to breed. And the way that they do that is the female will kind of nestle down in the rocks and a male will come in and latch himself onto the back of the female. 
Horseshoe crabs can breathe underwater or out of the water because a lot of the time when breeding's taking place, sometimes they're caught as the tide goes out too quickly and they can actually breathe air. Wow, I have really wanted to feature a horseshoe crab on Beyond the Tide and it's kind of being in the right place at the right time that we came across one of these giants. Look at that thing. It's as big as my face is. Whoa, I do have to watch out for that tail though. I don't want to get stabbed in the eye by it. Well, how cool was this? Coming across one of the most bizarre creatures you can ever stumble upon in the tide pools, the horseshoe crab. I'm Coyote Peterson. Be brave. Stay wild. We'll see you on the next one. Yo, no, no, bro. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I don't even know why. Let, let, let's just see how many they got. Let me just see how many subscribers they got real quick. Bro, bro, no, bro. 7.1, who watches this, man? What? Yo guys, that was this video. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more content. And I will see you all in the next video. Peace. <laughs>